everybody, my name is well my name is Amarillo Sky and welcome back to the forest now. Once again, my inventory glitched. So what I'm going to do is I'm just gonna make all these episodes back to back to back to back to back and hope for the best. Yeah. So fun fun times, kids. So um I have been having a hell of a time recording. Like I try to I usually like to record a nether before I record the forest and then I got irritated with the forest because my inventory glitched so I decided to go record nether first and I get on nether and I have an itch on my arm all the servers were down like they weren't down but you couldn't get into any of them no matter what I did I could not open any servers I could not get into the servers okay hold on we're gonna try something because I heard if you follow the uh never mind we're not gonna try something because that doesn't go anywhere um, all the servers were down on Nether. Like, I'd open one, and I would get stuck on this weird screen, and I wouldn't go anywhere. And I decided, okay, well, I'll wait here for a minute. And I waited, and waited, and waited, and waited. I sat here for about an hour, twiddling my thumbs and playing with my phone because I couldn't get Nether to work. So, and it's, I guess, I went camping the other day, and they, sweet, okay and they updated while I was camping and so I think something glitched and now nether is not working so we're not gonna have any nether content for and well until they get it fixed because I can't even open a server and I mean I hate to say that I should have planned ahead and made more servers but I didn't even think about it you know I mean I usually plan on being here every day and when I get up in the mornings I usually take my shower get on record my videos I can't do that anymore so instead we're gonna focus on the forest and trope for right now and if you guys I'll put a I'll put a list of games I own in the sweet fish no come back fishies come here fishy fishy I'll put a list of games I own and you guys can tell me which one you want me to play until uh, another fixes itself or gets fixed per se come back fishy no, I just want to be your friend. I just want to be your friend, fishy, fishy. Fishy, fishy, fishy. I just want to be your friend. Friends! Friends, that's all I want. I just want friends. In this game. In this place where there are no friends. I just want friends. Be my friend. Be my friend. Be my friend. So yes, this reminds me. While I was camping, we have this fun thing that we do where we get chicken liver. We own lakes. We own two small sand pit lakes that have a bunch of perch, we have a couple catfish, we have some bass in them. Well, perch we use for uh we use the perch for as bait fish and we wanted to go fishing. Well, we new items available to craft. Press I ooh. Okay, well first let's let's craft some of this. We'll put that on. We'll craft I don't have any corn, so we'll I really can't craft anything because I don't have anything to craft. Okay, so now we got Molotovs. I don't know if I'm saying that wrong. If I am, I'm fucked. <laughs> anyway, so we ha we tried to we decided to play this little game where what you do is you hold this small chunk of chicken liver in your hand, and when you're in the water, like if you're in the shallow, the perch will actually come up and nibble on your legs. And it feels really, really interesting. Like, it's a little peck on your leg. Like, it feels like a little bird is pecking on your leg. And they'll nibble on your legs and feet, and it eats all the dead skin off your legs and feet, so then your skin is nice and soft. Like, baby bottom soft. And it's amazing. But anyways, so we decided we wanted to catch some perch. But instead of sitting there and trying to catch them with a net, we all decided what we were going to do is stand about 10 feet apart from each other in the shallow water with chicken liver in our hands and catch them with our hands. And whoever got the mo caught the most perch with their hands got to uh, eat the first fish that was caught no matter who caught it and this is this may sound bad but this is something I already do I already catch perch with my hands anyways because it's really easy all you have to do is cup your hands around the uh, chicken liver and hold the chicken liver in the back of your hands and the perch will actually swim into your hands into the opening that the front of your hands create and you just have to close your hand over the perch and you've caught it without losing your chicken liver and so that's what I was doing and you kinda you can't see the water's a bit murky so you have to just kind of sit there and go by feeling them rub up against your hand and stuff. But uh, I uh, showed my fiancé, he came camping with us, I showed him how to do it and he ended up catching the most fish. And so, what do you know? 
You got to eat the first fish we caught. We only caught like three or four, and because we're on private property, we don't need fishing license to uh, catch fish. And we release most everything we catch. We usually keep the two biggest fish we catch. And we caught two bass and a catfish, and so we kept the catfish and the, one of the bass. And we had catfish and bass for dinner, and we had hobo dinners, and we had a blast. And now, now I'm back to this where I have to catch fish. I'm glad, I'm glad on my camping trip I didn't have to fend off cannibals, but now I have to fend off cannibals and catch fish and be awesome, and yeah. So, welcome back to the forest, guys. So yes, I'm going to make these next episodes back to back to back. That way I don't have to worry about, uh, whatchamacallit, losing my inventory. Head, arm, legs, other arm. No? Nope, there it is. Oop, okay. So we got the body parts. I really want to go out and see what happens when you get eaten by a shark. I really do. So I think in one of the videos, I'm going to do that. And I know there's a cave right there. There's a reason I'm not going in is because we're not prepared to go in it. Before I go into any cave, I want to make sure I've got the proper equipment to, uh, into a cave without having to worry about getting my butt handed to me on a silver cannibalistic platter. I don't know why I did that. I think I just picked up a ketchup bottle, guys. Oh, and then someone really, really, oh, what's his name? He said it in the comments. I mean, it's bad that I don't remember his name, but I saw the comment the other day. Someone said that the cassette player uh, actually isn't copyrighted, so I'm actually going to play the cassette player in this video because I'm really curious as to see what the music is. And they said that another really popular YouTuber, I think they said PewDiePie, which I don't watch PewDiePie, no offense to you guys, but I just don't enjoy watching PewDiePie. He's just, he's not funny to me, I mean. Everyone, everyone has the people they like to listen to, and I don't, and I've got my YouTubers that I like, but you know, I gave PewDiePie a shot. I watched him when he had uh, about 10 million subscribers, and I just didn't enjoy him. So I mean, I gave him, I give every YouTuber I watch a month, and if I don't enjoy them after a month, I don't watch them anymore. So I gave him a shot, and he just, I didn't enjoy his videos. He had some pretty good videos, but they just, they just weren't something I enjoyed enough to keep watching him. Anyways, enough about YouTubers. I probably just lost a couple subscribers for that, but that's okay. That's okay, I guess. We'll find more friends. Anyways, so they said that PewDiePie played the cassette player on his channel and that it wasn't copyrighted. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to listen to the cassette player as we work because apparently it helps restore your person's, your man's energy as he goes along. I think I did pick it up. Okay. And so we're, we're going to do that. Come on. I am stuck. Stuck, stuck, stuck. Okay. We need to hurry because the cannibals are going to start. What is going on here? I can't. And that shark is really, really close. Why am I? Oh, that's why. <laughs> Story of my life right there, guys. Got it. Okay. So we're going to try to get out from under the boat. Never. If you guys can avoid it, never swim under a boat. That's like the worst possible thing you could do. Never, ever, ever swim under a boat. Not even a small one. Even if you're a fantastic swimmer, never, if you can avoid it, swim under a, under a boat. That's a great way to get terribly injured. And we wouldn't want that now, would we? I didn't think so. So, okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to first set up a home. And once I get this actually positioned, I'll go ahead and start playing the cassette player because I really want to see what the music is. So, E. Okay, well, here we go.
So guys, that's the cassette player. Woohoo! That was actually, you know, it sounded like older music, but that was actually a kind of, kind of nice tune they had going there. So yes, cassette player. We now know what it sounds like. I hope I don't get in trouble for that. I'm gonna trust that random citizen. Oh, I wish I could remember his name. I even had it. I even tried to memorize it so that I could give him proper credit for informing me of such endeavors that you could play the cassette player. But I can't. I'll probably mention him in the next video when I jump on YouTube to go check what his name was. So yes, yes, yes. Okay, so I need one more stick. I usually see uh, the cannibals by now. Where are they? They, they have come to be a uh, common common occurrence. They usually show up on the beach by now. I mean, it's been... I'm not complaining, mind you, but I'm kind of surprised they haven't showed up yet. Okay, so now we want... No, what? why did I pick that? We want effigies. The almighty effigy. Arms and legs everywhere. Jeez, this is like a gory, gory... What did I need? Sticks and rocks. Rocks and sticks. I'm just like running around pressing E. I'm pathetic. I don't even want to actually look. And now it's raining. Rock. I just need four more sticks. Three more sticks. One more stick. I has sticks, guys. I has sticks. I need heads now. Die. No? I've gotten to the point where I know that guy's just gonna be my my uh, companion on the beach. Hello, turtle. Goodbye, turtle. Head. Did they fix the head thing? Oh, I think they did. Where you get two heads from a body. Dang it. It's like they kind of carry around a second head in their pocket. Just to do it. Okay, so here we go. What is your favorite survival movie, kiddos? All you fans out there, you know, the I think there's 16 of you now. Woohoo, 16! All of you dear friends out there, what is your current favorite survival movie? Say it in the comments below. I think, and this is going to sound bad, I think mine would be Jurassic Park or Jurassic Park 3. I didn't really enjoy the second one. But I, I love dinosaurs. I mean, I watched the first Jurassic Park movie back when I was six I walked in on my dad watching it and he's like Aaron watch this yes Aaron's my name by the way guys Amarillo watch this and I turned and the guy got eaten off the toilet by a ty 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 Tyrannosaurus Rex it made my week and now I'm obsessed with the movie so lo and behold Jurassic Park is my favorite survival movie no doubt about it so what is your guys's what is all your guys's favorite survival movies medicine. I'm wasting time, I know. I'm wasting time waiting for the cannibals to show up because they usually do. That way I can get more heads for my effigy. And I think these respawn over, respawn over time. Not entirely sure, but uh... They took care of the tennis ball problem. There was not... I think there was like one tennis ball in all of those. Goodness, I hated the problem with the tennis balls in every single. I keep thinking I'm seeing the cannibals when I'm looking at my effigy. I'm like, oh look, cannibals! Oh, tennis ball. Go figure. Right after I said that. Okay, so... One of these nights, guys, we're just gonna get drunk on the booze in this game. Okay, so it said that we can... Arm? Combine? No. I said that there was things we can make now. Remove. Oh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a fire. We're gonna make a nice warm fire because I'm getting cold. No, this one. I'm gonna set right here. There we go. 
I need more everything. Hey, hi, look, look at this head. It's just kind of like, mm, yes, baby. I don't know if you guys can hear me like slamming my fingers into the keys trying to find uh, rocks. I need two more rocks, two more stones, two more stones. Uno, dos. Aww, oh, really? Really, what's this? Nom 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 medicine. I'll have to remember that's up there. I think that, I think I actually saw that in one of my other videos. I just forgot about it. Gimme, give gimme give the stick, thank you. Whew. We're in luck, those aren't poisonous. <gasps> Rabbit! I missed. Come back here. I just want to be your friend, Thumper. just want to be your friend, I promise. I promise. I need a coconut. I, if any of you get that reference, I need a coconut to be my friend. But alas, there are no coconuts in this game. Log. I kind of wish I could get that freaking effigy built before I go to bed, but I really can't. And I don't want to wake up with a whole bunch of cannibals staring at me like, why'd you chop up our friends? Is that going to roll away? There we go. That works for me. What am I missing? Oh, I need more rocks, gee. <sighs> oh, my phone went black on my timer. I was watching that timer. Oop, got it. Hello, seagull. My log is rolling away. Bad log. Bad. There we go. It got dark. Drop the log. This is unnerving. See that glow up there? The glow on that branch? That, that's a little... Hello. Okay, okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna ju jump... I know I'm cold and wet. Okay, so... Let's see. Here we go. Moment of truth. Anyone? Uh, uh, eh. No, come back, log. Where? Are, where is everyone? Where? 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 Where are all the cannibals? 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 Por favor. Cannibals, please. Plucks. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna feed the fire. Okay. Well, I'm all out of time, guys. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I'm gonna go ahead and start filming them back to back and get a couple filmed real quick. <gasps> is that a feather? It is. Can I pick it up? Feather, please. Feather. No. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and start filming the next episode after this. That way, I've got a couple episodes filmed. Ah, crap. <laughs> Go figure. My log is like, I don't want to be your friend. So I will see you all in the next episode. If you enjoyed this video, like, share, favorite, subscribe, share it with someone. I think I just said that already. And I will see you all in the next episode. Thank you and bye-bye.